the summer come out tomorrow. So you got I'm Jack Topping and I am eleven years old and I sing at the Metropolitan Cathedral Choir. He's been described as the choir boy sensation. There's no doubt about it. You're going to be hearing a lot more from Jack Topping. I just love singing, so I just feel extremely lucky that I have a good voice. And it's just amazing how, how this opportunity has come. And I just feel so lucky. Jack, who lives near Wigan, has been part of the choir for more than three years. When talent scouts heard him sing, they signed him up for a multi-album deal. Unknown to us, somebody must have heard Jack sing and, um, and told somebody else and, and it, it took off from there. Somebody uh, phoned up the cathedral and said, could we come along and listen to Jack? We've heard that you have a young boy in the choir that um, has got an amazing voice and we'd love to come and meet him. And, you know, and it's just amazing. It, it took Jack to signing so that, you know, the... Uh, Signing a record deal. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. It's been a busy summer for Jack. Apart from spending his time in the recording studio, he's also been to South Africa. The 11-year-old is an ambassador for Save the Children. It's just amazing how the, how all the children are, are really happy and they all love life. And because the boy said that he loves it living in the house, and his house was only small, made out of tin. I had to share a bed with four people. I don't think I could cope with that. Decca Records is the company that famously failed to sign the Beatles, but with two covers from the Fab Four on Jack's debut album, they may be making up for lost time. I just probably gonna think it's unreal. <laughs> like one minute I'm in the cathedral choir, next minute I've got an album coming out. <laughs> Jack's still getting used to his newfound fame, but with his tracks getting national airplay, he'd better get used to this. This is one boy with a bright tomorrow. Andy Bonner, ITV News, Liverpool.